bump up the cap of people that can be on your friend list. What was the cap before? I was like a hundred. I think they might have, because TF uh, was. I was able to add TF eventually, and I, I don't know if you deleted somebody or not, but. Or does anyone uh, know the server, maybe? Guys, an enemy chopper! Yeah, if yeah, you look uh, up. Hold on, if you give me a sec to uh, alt tab, I will get it. Okay, let me alt tab. Oh, hey, someone killed me while I was alt tab. It's okay. But yeah, hey, uh, you know, I never know, but if I'm ever in uh, Kentucky or Missouri, I'll definitely hit you guys up. Cool. Yeah, if you're here in time for the browning, I'll let you shoot it. Oh, I would love to. I mean, I'd, I'd help pay for the ammo and shit, too, so... What the fuck oh, is okay. obliteration? No, I know that. <laughs> Dude, I know. Trust Welcome me. to a single flag ammo, CTF, also known as obliteration. Ammo cheap to begin with, but I know 50 cal ammo is fucking stupid expensive. It's like they combine single flag CTF and rush. But yeah, you know, one day I might find myself in Missouri and I'd love to hang out with, uh, you Kilroy, or if I'm in Kentucky, Confucius. If I'm in Kentucky, Confucius to the Jew Bros, and shoot guns. Go, Hacker, go! Uh, yeah, that, that attack chopper. Attack yeah. chopper. Come on, Confucius, you know you want to be Jew Bros. Is he even still here? Uh, he's in Mumble, I don't know where he is. So what is this, like? Okay, so basically you see that round thing on your uh, on the map? That's that's the bomb. It's red when the enemies have it, blue when your team has it, and gray when no one it's has it. It's kind of strike mode, basically. Also, Kilroy, if you're ever in LA, um, you always have a place to stay. Once you have the bomb, you take it to one of the bomb sites and plant it. Well, yeah, the like kind of appreciate it. I will never be in LA. That's fine. I'm just saying, if you ever happen to find yourself here, you have a place to stay, and I will go to the range. And that's the one thing I'm pissed off. I mean, I would love to live in New York, but that's the one thing I would hate about living in New York is that there's no fucking ranges in city in the city. Actually, there are. There is one, but you have to like have certain. You have to be like police or some shit like that. Well, of course, police have ranges because you know how the NYPD practice their shooting civilian skill. No, 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 there's one public range that you can get in if you're not police, but I forget exactly the, uh, fucking... Exact everything about it. Well, it's probably not in Manhattan proper, is it? It is, it is in Manhattan oh, proper. It's in, it's in the lower, it's in, like, uh, downtown... Look out, bomb carrier! I forget exactly where it is, but I think it's below 20th Street. Ah, fuck, I saw him. What happens at 20th Street that gives you a visual reference to... Suggest um, that. I, I don't know, it's ne kinda near NYU. It's kinda near the, uh, you know, Washington Square, shit like that. Uh, Washington, no, Washington Square's down on 3rd Street. Washington Square, I think it's on 4th. 14th, rather, 14th. Mm, I'm pretty sure it's on 3rd, but I'll double check. I'll look it up right now. I'm already there. Oh man, that attack chopper. Someone finally got it. Oh, it's it. way further north than I thought it was. Never mind. Yeah, you're. It's 14th, isn't it? Well, well first of all, I was thinking of not Washington Square. Yeah, I can't attack the guy. It's 5th Ave and. Some unnamed street. Washington Square. 7th Street, there it is. Oh, 14th is a fucking uh, Union Union Square. Third Street is where the NYU dorm is that overlooks. That's why I was. Uh... What have you been doing? A girl I dated uh, was in finance, and she had an internship at Lehman Brothers, and they oh, kept her at the dorm there. Um, hey man, if I'm ever in New York, the same thing. Just let me know, by the way. Where do you even live, Hadlock? Dallas. Oh, sorry. But yeah, you know, I would be happy to give up guns to live in New York City because it is such a fucking cool place. I've been there a couple times. Um, I really love up. it. I mean, I have a lot of friends there. I also have Can we get rid of the LAB? Um, but yeah, Philadelphia is also fun as shit. And, uh. Yeah. There's the LAV. It's a D in that little canyon. Fuck. 
Oh, I'm, just a little bit, awesome. I'm just a little bit pissed at my parents because they have actually have a place up in the, in the Hudson Valley and I totally wanted to buy gum, but my mom's like, no, never. My dad's like, yeah, whatever. But I honestly think, my mom's never shot a gun, but I honestly think if she ever did, she'd be like, that's so cool. <laughs> look, I mean, look, my whole family is very liberal. All of us are. But my brother, sister, and I are all, like, guns are totally cool, and there should be gun laws, but, you know, guns should still be legal. I mean, guns being legal is not the cause of the problems, right? Well, it is. Depends what you mean by the problems. It's not, well, the, the problem the is prob that we made guns, and that's it, there's no going back, really. I mean, the problem for us mass shootings is not the issue with Why guns. Why did that C4 not stick? Why I guess Bobby not planning the bomb? I guess what I'm saying about guns is that the more the problem <laughs> the puppy's is... puppy's gotta figure it out. Wow, that puppy was stupid. I guess more the problem with guns is, uh, uh, you know, people that can legally get them that would not normally be able to legally get them getting guns. I don't think most of the people that do the mass shootings are the fuck kind of people that would be obtaining them illegally. Right? I think the government should take them. They actually, have. pretty much. They're, like, not illegally, but someone was clearly not doing their job right. No, exactly, but I mean, like, like, look, you look at, like, fucking, uh, the school shooting in Connecticut, right? That person would not have gotten guns if they were legal. That's true. I'm not gonna argue with that. But the issue is we need to have better background checks. The background check system worked just fine in that case. He didn't Someone take the out gun. the fucking LA. Right, it was his mother. Right, it was his mother. I guess what I'm saying is that LED mother. just destroys all of our helicopters and it really takes away a lot Look, of our advantage. Kilroy, I don't know, do you believe in gun control or not? I believe that I should not have to pay for a machine gun, but I did. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, like but, but do you, you believe pity your in salary gun control? for machine gun? I think you should have to pay 30 grand for the bullets. Do you believe that some people should not be allowed to buy guns? I guess My real opinion. Right. No, I don't. I think everybody should be able to own a gun. Okay. Fuck it. I was just curious on your opinion, sir. That LAV is almost dead if someone can shoot a rocket at it. It's on the bridge by D. I was prepping a jihad jeep. And I don't know. I think, it. I think the guns the are of in this level make jihad jeep really hard. cool, and I think they're a, a cool freedom to have. Oh, somebody put up the bullets. But I don't know how I... I think there should be some gun control. I don't think there should be outlawed guns. I think there should certainly be outlawed guns. Why? There are certain guns that are clearly like built for mass shootings. Like imagine if they just sold grenade launchers. They do. They do. They do. Yeah. Wait, you do? But well, they are more restricted. That's true. Kilroy, I am gonna fucking book a flight out to fucking Missouri just to shoot that grenade launcher. <laughs> Uh, grenade launchers are not hard things to make. In fact, there are many ways easier to make than a working gun. The issue Anyways. is that ammunition is fucking expensive. You know, each one is yep. yep. destructive. Okay, that, that's no, the I point. I'm attack. sorry. I, I should have used another gun, but, like, you know, you, you get my point. How much is a grenade for a grenade launcher? Hundreds. Uh, hundreds of dollars for a single grenade? Yeah. Wow. Really it's going to be at least, law enforcement gets even if you got the actual thing for free, you still have to pay a $200 tax stamp for it. So, and that's on top of the base cost. But I still think that guns are, are pretty awesome. I mean, and I don't know. I don't think they should be completely legal. Um, I think there are certain things that should be legal, obviously, but... If I could know my MG34 or M16A2... Oh, no, 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 no I'm not M2, talking about that. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking more like fucking rocket launchers and shit. Were you here earlier when I... Seriously considered getting oh, a tank. A when you seriously- Oh, yeah, 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 I was. But yeah, but they're d the so it doesn't tank? even matter. How much yeah, are that even cost? I can get it... ...re-milled. That's just for import purposes. I, I guess the point is, is... Tank stands and shit. You can have that cannon work on. Really? Oh, I thought that'd be illegal. Yeah. Again, I don't see the need for a fucking working tank, honestly. Uh, uh working tank and gun. I mean, I'm not uh, gonna... I want a fucking tank. Well, no, of course, but I'm not gonna say that, you know, like, um... 
there is any like legitimate need for like guns certainly legitimate need for hunting or whatever right but when you get into like rocket launchers and tanks and shit like it would be totally awesome to own but i don't think it's legitimate need Uh, I don't want to argue about and maybe, No, I'm not, I don't want to argue either, and maybe I'm just a dirty fucking liberal, but, um, I've stopped just expressing my opinion. Oops. Look, don't nice get me wrong, job. I you think... Nice job, got the objective. Kilroy, don't nice. get me wrong, I think guns are fucking awesome and I would love to shoot them, so... Even if I could shoot a fucking rocket launcher, I would totally do that in a heartbeat. You just don't think, Joe, every man should have access to a rocket launcher? I guess, yeah. Because I think, you know, Joe Everyman is not as intelligent as a lot of people, as a lot of us are. And you know what, it shouldn't be based on, a, a lot of the, the gun restrictions are based on money. It should money. be based, based on, on race and true. income. <laughs> <laughs> it and already whether you own property so. or not. Yeah, it pretty much is. Like, oh, you have $30,000 here, you can have a, a it's ridiculous. Yeah, but Look, if I'm you have a turret on your head, think, you should be allowed to get a rocket launcher. I'm not saying that I don't think people should be able to own them. I'm saying I don't think there's a need for them. Are you saying there's not a need for me to have a Gatling gun on my roof? Yes, because I guess the argument oftentimes with... And Kilroy can probably back this up, but I guess the argument is often, you know, if the government decides to do something, right? They the will have the, We'll have these things to the back government. Us. We'll have these things to back us up, but the fact of the matter is, is that if the government sucks to do anything, they'll fucking drop smart bombs. I mean, it's, it's, I have eyes at this point, it's, it's a fucking no-win situation. The government. I have no dog in that fight about the you know, okay. whole revolution shit that's... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's, <laughs> that's, a, that's a silly argument. Spotted enemy tank. Hostile AT soldiers spotted to east. <laughs> That's my basis for the argument. I want a Gatling gun. Dude, I would fucking love to comes. shoot a Gatling gun. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ, I would love to shoot a fucking, uh, fucking minigun. I would love a Gatling gun in an ammo factory so I could yeah, get a difference between a minigun and a Gatling gun. Okay, yes, yeah, Gatling yeah. got the approach to the Civil War. I know. They're from the Civil War, they're man bomb doing. Spot but the fucking tank I'm, if you're I'm shooting at it. Where the heck is our bomb carrier going? Kilroy, correct me if I'm wrong, but a Gatling gun can definitely refer to any multi barrel fucking machine gun. The minigun is a type of Gatling gun, you think so? Yeah, I would totally say that. Same here. But it'll be yeah. something more feasible, like an MG32 or something like that. Like, that'd be awesome. Where the heck is our bomb? Anyways, oh, there it is. so, kill right. I got it now, I'm running. Why I'm still trying I'm to convince dying. my parents to get a gun is because they have horrible fucking groundhog problems, which is eating into their fucking, you know, foundation. And also, uh, yeah. their problems, which are eating all their shit. I'm like, just get a fucking gun and scare them off, or kill the groundhog. Get one of those, uh, planting pressed air. Well, I mean, I very well may just keep it up there for the grand box, but, um, I still think, you know, you a shooter, like a regular 22 rifle would do them just fine for the grand box. Yeah. And also, got they're up in the fucking, essentially, they're up in the country. They have, like, what, like, uh, fucking 10 acres or some shit like that? Or a shotgun, because shotguns are fun. Okay, uh, uh, whoever's in my squad, Dick Justice, you need to get to the top of the tower and until I don't we got its laziness. Here, but I think if you shot towards them but not hit them a couple times, they'd never come back. Hmm. Confirm, deny, anybody? I, I, I don't know. It probably depends on the animal, but they probably can't all perceive what bullets are very well. No, but they know what they know what the sounds are, they know what like danger is, and they will try to stay away from danger. No, that, that's what I mean. A bullet whizzing past them might not be something they can understand as But the sound they can fucking you. understand. The fucking bang. Well yeah, once one of them actually hit my stuff. Loud yeah, that's what I was said to be hearing. They'd be hearing the I mean they come really close up to the house. I don't like, think that'd be enough to scare them away. Permanently you mean? Yeah. Yeah, I mean they'll run well, then they just gotta uh, fucking get a deer down. license and fucking take out a deer every now and then. Fuck Christ. Now, are deer licenses Probably only pellets. for, um, bucks, or are they also for does? You can get it for does. Oh god, this vehicle. 
Anyway, so I'll be back in a, in a, I don't know, 10 minutes or something. Uh, okay. You guys will still be here, right? In approximately a day. Kilroy? I've got a yeah, bomb and an enemy attack chopper is trying right, to kill me right now. What's the most uh, FPS taxing thing in the settings? It probably depends entirely on your computer, but I'm gonna say HBAO. Or how low yeah, it is. Yeah, I figured. If I deploy on the chopper, it just deploys me on the ground. Yeah, that's nice. Going to the department store. Alright. Come on. Have a good night. Good night. Yeah, and I gotta go all the way to E. And I'm dead in the department store. I guess this will be everyone's last round. That's yeah, fun playing with you guys, Hadlocker and everyone. And facial. Indeed. Yep. Finally got my ACWR. I'm happy. What? He took the bomb to the roof. What? Oh, that guy. Now we gotta get it from the roof. I got it. Oh god, Chopper, no! I got this shit, yo. Okay, come on, let's go towards E. Oh, no, it's still on, it's still on the roof. They have it again. Hey, he's taking the elevator down, though. Okay, I'll That's try stupid. to meet him at the elevator. He's got like three friends in the elevator, I think. Yeah, this game still lags tonight. What the elevator doors are. <laughs> that was so not hilarious. Proof, so. <laughs> elevator scene, I gotta admit. I'm going up so I can parachute off. Somebody hit the button, fuck! <laughs> Everybody elevator. just stared. <laughs> we got a full elevator here. <laughs> oh, no one's on the roof. Okay, we're, we're good. Oh god, someone is on the roof. Ah, I got fucking pulled by NPC. Uh, oh, above us, above the us! They're on the roof right above the elevator. Come on, bomb carrier, let's go. Oh god, why would you shoot the... Bomb is down, still in the middle of the shopping center. Facial, no! I advanced it a whole few s meters. Okay, I'm spawning in our uh, transport chopper. You're headed towards an LAV, whoever's got the bomb. I've got a visual on an enemy helicopter east of your location. Where is that LAV? It's uh, closer to their spawn, really. I think I hit it pretty hard. I think it took it all the way back to their spawn to repair. No, now it's no, 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 it's a tank. I should have figured the tank could see me in there. We did it! Woo! Congratulations! That was fun. Awesome job, everyone! Three to zero, not bad. I miss Rush, though. The well, Rush will be back. Rush That's sucked good. in BF3. Well, uh, Rush was, was better fun. on the uh, old maps for some reason. I guess because they were more open. Bad and Company 2 was awesome for Rush. That is true, well, but it yeah, was built it was around, Rush. around Rush. Yeah. Conquest was like an afterthought. Bingo. And the Conquest maps usually weren't that good. But anyway, thanks for playing. Then they uh, even we'll, like. We'll, I'm gonna stick around for another round, later. I think. Wait, you're gonna stick around for another round? Yeah, why not? There's we've got 20 people on the channel. Oh wait, no, that's a. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We've only got six people on the channel. I think it's yeah. only you and me in this uh, on the server anymore. I'm here. Oh hey, Bob. How you doing, Bob? 
Yeah, okay. Well, if we got Bob, join our squad and we'll do one more round. How's that? Yeah. You might as well give the people what they're, what they're asking for. And that's more obliteration. I, I'm, I'm thinking obliteration is probably going to shine on larger, more open maps as well. Where uh, the vehicles come more into play. This is sort of medium sized. I might just play only Obliteration. This is a lot more fun than uh, Conquest. <laughs>